Hi guys, welcome or welcome back. This is Budget with Jess and in today's video we're going to be doing a expense tracking and kind of an unstepping video. So if you're interested in this type of content, go ahead and keep on watching. Excuse my voice, I'm a little bit sick right now, but hopefully I can get through this video. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, so this is how I do kind of my expense tracking. I, uh, I try to use cash as much as I can, but you know, sometimes just cash isn't like, I'm not able to pay with it. And so I do use my credit cards or my actual like debit card in some instances. So I have my expenses right here that I've done. Um, I'm a little bit behind. So I'm gonna do, I still have some from like the end of June and then the beginning of July. So let's go ahead and get started. So let's go ahead and, and just add this up and hopefully I have it correct. So I miscounted something. I have here $318, but somehow I have, in what I had added before, I have $372. So I'm just gonna start unstuffing and see what happens. This always happens to me. The math somehow just does not math correctly, and I don't know why. I'm gonna keep my calculator over here. Uh, I have some change right here that I have. I have 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. So I have $30 right here. I should really try to figure out how the numbers are so wrong. But I honestly don't have the energy right now. Okay, so $30 there. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Let's get started with some of these. <clears throat> okay, so we have for gas, we have 42.34 plus 54.35. So that is 96.69. And I don't think I have that here. Let me see how much I have in here. I have 20, 40, 60, 80. So I have $80 and let's see. So I need 17 more dollars from put 20 here and I'm going to get it from my buffer. I think I should have enough in here. So let's see 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. I have exactly $17 from here. So that's gonna be all for my buffer. Take these receipts out. Okay, so we are done with gas. Sorry if you hear children screaming. Um, I don't know why they're screaming. <laughs> uh, groceries, I haven't bought any groceries as uh, yet, so that's gonna get skipped. Eating out will have uh, 15, 12, So it's 34.70, so it'll be 35. I just like to round it up. So this has 20, 40, 50, 60, so 35. So I'm gonna put 20 and get a five back. And eating out still has 10, 20, 25. Do you guys all feel like you're getting sick right now? It's like the time that everyone's getting sick. <laughs> Okay, so we have eating out, that one, that one, that one. And eating out, it's basically my lunch at work. <laughs> okay, so then we're gonna go into personal. We have five plus 7.33 plus five. Okay, so we have 32.32, and I have $40 here, so I'm gonna do 33. So I need $7 back. So personal has $7 left. Okay. 
Okay, so personal, that one is done, that one, that one, and that one. Okay, so then let's now go to, I have been spending anything in coffee, and then nothing in buffer. So my wallet is done. Okay, we have that out of the way. So now let's go into this binder. Whoa into this binder and out of this one we're gonna take out uh, for babies we're gonna take out $26 this was for the tra 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 uh, for the <laughs> it's the medication that they give them for the fireworks um, I had bought it already and I remember when I left that vet that day, I put it in my purse and I remember taking it out in my kitchen table and it was nowhere to be found. Like, I don't know where that pill bottle went. I don't know if it was thrown away by accident. I have no idea. So I had to uh, have it prescribed again and go and buy it, but it's okay. They needed it. So they're gonna get, it was $26. I'm still also waiting for the insurance to reimburse me. What is it like 70% of this? So when I get it, I'll, um, I'll restuff it in their um, envelope. So now they have 100, 200, 250, 270, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79. So 279. So let's see, where are they? 26. Okay, and I don't think I have anything else from here. No, okay, not from here. And then I'm gonna go into this binder and we're gonna pull out out of supply, I mean supplies, out of annuals because I had to pay my Costco membership and I forgot that I have Walmart Plus. I think I got it last year because they had like a promotion going on and I think it was only $50. Totally forgot to like take it out of like auto pay and they took out the full amount. So it's okay, it's fine. It was $107, I can't do anything about it. I'm going to um, cancel it because I mean, it's good, but I don't think I need it. But hopefully I'll cancel it for next year. So that was that was one hundred seven eighty plus the sixty dollars for Costco. So I need one sixty eight. So I have a hundred dollars in the bank. So I'll take that out and then twenty forty sixty. We'll take out seventy and put two dollars in here. So now that's one hundred twenty forty sixty seventy. So that sucks that I totally forgot about that membership, but it is what it is. <laughs> so now, um, Anil's has one, two, three, four, five, six. So it has six dollars. Yay. Um, I don't think I have any more annual bills coming up, uh, right now. Uh, so I think I should be okay to save for next year. So that is this one and this one and then the last one i think it's gonna be supplies and that's gonna come from my business binder i know i bought something for my etsy shop uh, i don't remember what it was but it was something so supplies was 15 so i'm gonna put a 20 back i mean put it 20 and get five dollars back so now supplies has 150 100 105 And we are done with that one. And I think that we are done with all of this. So let me just count to see how much there is in here. I'm gonna take out $30 just cause that's what, uh, what I had as change. So we have 100, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seventy. One, two, three, four. Three seventy four. And that is what I had in my actual like notebook. So I don't know what math I'm doing here that I was doing wrong. Like I said, I don't want to try to figure it out. My head hurts. So I have 374 and the total should have been 372. Three seventy two and some change, but let me count it one more time. One hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, two, twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, three, twenty, forty, fifty, six, sixty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, seventy, one, two, three, four. So I have three seventy four here, so I have enough to pay my credit cards back. So that is good to go um and that is how i basically do my expense tracker thingy right here um it's pretty straight to the point this is how i try to keep on track with my um with my expenses with anything that i need to pay myself back for that way i don't i'm not carrying balances on my credit card and i'm not going uh into debt doing so so i like to do it at the end of the week i know some people like to do it at the end of the month me because i cashed up every week it helps me keep myself more accountable with how much money I have towards the end of the week. So hopefully that makes sense to you guys. And hopefully this is helpful, gives you ideas on how to do your own um, tracking. And if you have stayed this long, thank you so much for watching. Um, subscribe if you haven't. Like this video and comment down below. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye.